If they prioritize education and working first, they miss that opportunity to have a child when they're at their yeah. prime fertility years. She can rectify that wrong because she got the kids out the way and she can pursue that career after the fact. Yeah. But if she does it the other way around, she might end her I ability mean, to have children in the future. Not to I, knock any old uh, people, but like re-entering the workforce when you're 40 years old, that's a tall order. That's incredibly is. difficult to do. But at least it's possible. You can have a kid at 40. That's possible too. Yeah. Uh, in fact, exactly. it's probably easier to have a kid at 40 than it is to go into the workforce after being out of it for 20 yeah, years. Down. Actually, yeah, absolutely it is, of course. No. Also, you, you think women at 40 can't have kids? Dude, yeah, I mean, let's be honest here. That's a, that's a yeah. high risk pregnancy risk. after high, 35. It's higher risk, higher. but it's not ultra it's high risk. risk. But as opposed to a woman at 40 being like, but here Steven, I am, now I'm going to go get a job. What, Steven, programming? I would argue that a woman has a higher chance of landing a job at 40, re-entering the workplace and getting an education, thanks to affirmative action, maybe she goes into your job field that's dominated by men, versus being 40 years old and trying to bring right. a child to full term. Sure, you would just be completely wrong. Do you think it's like a 70% chance of like a miscarriage? A woman gets pregnant at 40? It's significantly I mean, higher, bro. Nice significantly like 90% of her eggs are gone at that point. You don't need 100% of your eggs to have a child. You don't need one. You're correct. If you take 100 women that are 40 and you knock all of them up, there's going to be more successful pregnancies than if you take 100 women who haven't been in the workforce for 20 years and try to get them into careers. That's like almost impossible. Oh so we tried it after NAFTA. Remember with the whole learn to code movement for truckers just and shit where people were saying like, oh, like truckers can just learn computer programming.